Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to walk through a super useful trick how to embed a Google Sheet directly into your Google Sites website. By the end of this tutorial, you'll be able to make any updates to your Google Sheet and see them reflected instantly on your website, making your content dynamic and always up to date. So whether you're sharing a schedule, a budget, or anything that needs to be interactive or updated on the fly, this guide has you covered. Let's dive right in. First, open up your Google Sheet, the one you want to display on your site. At the top left, click on File, then hover down to the Share option, and from there, select Publish to the web. This step is really important because before anything can be seen on your site, it needs to be publicly accessible. Don't worry, it doesn't always mean everyone can edit it. You're just allowing it to be viewed. A new window should pop up. Click that big green Publish button. You may get a warning asking if you're sure you want it published. Go ahead and confirm. What this does is it makes your sheet viewable as a live web page. If you're worried about privacy or who can see your data, just double check your sharing settings before moving forward. If you ever want to stop sharing it later, you can always unpublish. Once it's published, you'll notice two tabs, Link and Embed. Click on the Embed tab, this is where the magic happens. You'll see a box with some HTML code inside. Go ahead and copy this entire block of code, it usually starts with iframe. This bit of code acts kind of like a window, allowing your sheet to be displayed directly on another page, in this case, your Google site. Now switch over to your Google Sites project. Just open up the page where you want to add your spreadsheet. On the right-hand panel, you'll see an option called Embed. It usually has this little angle bracket icon. Click that button and a box will appear asking for your embed code. Simply paste what you copied from Google Sheets into this box. Here's a little pro tip. If you want your embedded sheet to look great on your page, no weird sizing, find the word iframe inside the code you just pasted. Right after iframe, type in width equals 100% and height equals 750 pixels in quotation marks. So it should look something like width equals 100% height equals 750 px. This tells your browser to stretch the spreadsheet to fill the available space and gives it a nice, readable height. If you need your sheet to appear taller or shorter, you can always play with that height number later, but 750 pixels is a solid start for most lists or tables. Once you've made these tweaks, hit Next or Insert, depending on what Google Sites shows you, and that's it, it's really that simple. In just a few clicks, your interactive, always updated Google Sheet is live on your website. Visitors can scroll, view the data, and always see the latest info you've added to your sheet. If you ran into any hiccups along the way, maybe the code didn't paste right, or your sheet isn't displaying how you want. Don't worry, just retrace the steps and check those little details, like the width and height, or whether your sheet is really published to the web. Thanks so much for following along. If you found this tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up, and if you've got any questions or if there's another trick with Google Sites or Google Sheets you want to learn, drop a comment below, I always love hearing from you. And don't forget to subscribe for more easy-to-follow tech tutorials just like this one. See you in the next video.